Some disturbing testimony at the 67th District Court. Three witnesses detailing their abuse by Father DiLorenzo. The first witness testified that his abuse began as early as first grade at the age of seven while attending Holy Redeemer Catholic School in Burton. Father Vincent DiLorenzo, a former priest of Genesee County, sexually assaulted him in his office at the school's church next door multiple times. The assault included and went beyond touching his genitals. The witness says at that young age, he seen DiLorenzo as a parent after losing his mother at just two years old. DiLorenzo was also someone he admired and had a strong influence on his life. The second witness said his abuse began at just five years old on the day of his great-grandmother's funeral, a service that DiLorenzo officiated. After the funeral, family and friends gathered at the witness's grandmother's home. That's where the witness says DiLorenzo seen he was emotional and asked his grandparents if he could speak with him in private. But instead, DiLorenzo sexually assaulted him. He says that DiLorenzo threatened him, saying if he told anyone, his his uncle would not become a priest and that no one would believe him. And the final witness to testify said his abuse began at the age of eight at a church sleepover. It started out with back rubs, then quickly escalated to Father DiLorenzo touching his genitals. He said the former priest would also spoil him by taking him shopping, out to dinner, and giving him money. When he tried to confront DiLorenzo about the incidents at the age of 31, he said the former priest stated that he wanted to put his mother in the ground before he dealt with what happened. Father DiLorenzo's bond was doubled and is now at $200,000. Reporting in Genesee County, Jamie Sherrod, WNEM TV5.